Finally here? Okay, yeah, this is what I have been missing. Okay, people, eyes on me. Let's set up camp and get ready to leave for the petroglyphs in the morning. This island is ours for the next 36 hours. So get to your camp assignments. Let's go. Move. Need help with that? Oh, thanks. Okay, let's get the tents up, gather wood before it gets dark. I'll build the fire pit. Darwin? Let's go. You, uh, you're in the army, right? Yeah. Reserves, technically, still. Did you camp a lot? 
survival training, wilderness training. So, yes. Good. This is all new to me. I'm used to the Southern California desert. It's definitely a different kind of heat. The humidity here is killer. I'm already so sticky. It's been, what, five, 10 minutes? It's so good for your skin. I mean, I'm always so dry. I was stationed in the desert, so it's new to all of us. Still, I'm glad that you're here. Don't forget, I've been going to remote reinforced locations for decades. You got nothing to worry about. <laughs> I know, I know you're a legend, but there's five of us and only one of you. How old were you when you first visited Amazon? Oh, a little younger than you, probably, as an undergrad. You were running around South America in the 80s. Any stories about the cartel? Uh, just a few bribes here and there. I was in the middle of the Amazon. The cartel <laughs> was the least of my worries. I can't stop thinking about that boat we saw on the way in here. What do you think left of there? I don't know. I mean, who knows if they're even still around? How long do you think somebody would last out here on their own? A minor injury is a death sentence. Yeah, man, it's got to be recent. I mean, a boat like that couldn't last too many storms in its condition. Maybe it's a park ranger. This is Colombian-owned land, right? Uh, yeah, it's government land, but I don't think this is a park. So not a park ranger, but like, I don't know, government wildlife official, something, right? Yeah. Maybe. Maybe. <laughs> All right. We're back. You got firewood. Well, that's the start. Help me build a fire. Okay, let's go over this one more time, okay? It's backcountry hiking. Five hours in, five hours out. We'll hike to the petroglyphs, take our photos, document it for the journals, and head back here. Got it? Yes. Copy that. Yeah? Yep. Got it. Is the drone ready, Benji? I'll see a few minutes in the morning to recalibrate it, but yes. It should be able to automatically survey the islands and be back at camp when we return. Good. Remember, that's where our grant money's coming from. We got to make sure we get the cartographic survey. You understand? Shouldn't be an issue. Great. All right, guys. What time are we going to do this? Uh... Hello? Show yourself. Don't, don't shoot. Don't move. Please don't shoot. I, I, help. I, I need help. Water, please. I'm so thirsty, please. Allison, we have extra water. No, come on in, have a seat. It's okay. My boat destroyed. No sé. No sé. Gracias. Gracias. Thank you. I lost my partner. He was, a. Uh... it's just me out here. Just me. No, now you. What was his name? Rex. Did you actually lose Rex, or did he pass away? He's dead. A snake. Bite. Our helicopter will turn day after tomorrow. It'll be tight, but we can squeeze you in, even if we have to leave some gear behind. It's okay. I have money. 
I will repay you, I promise. I, I will pay for my passage. Don't worry about it. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Perdóname, I, I didn't introduce myself. Joaquin. Nice to make your acquaintance, Joaquin. I'm Dr. Malone, professor of anthropology at CRU, and these are some of my graduate research assistants. I'm Jason. Here. We got more. Adam, nice to meet you. Grace. Benji. Allison. Nice to meet you all. Sorry if I interrupted. Uh, I heard the helicopter and saw the smoke, and I, I wasn't too far. Oh, like I said, don't worry about it. Well, it's getting late. We have uh, an early morning. Where are you sleeping tonight? Down by the beach. Little, not too far. Yeah, I think uh, we're going to be calling it a night, Joaquin. I'll return back in the morning. I, I don't want to continue to impose. Nonsense. Look, we don't have an extra tent, but we have fire, we have water, and you're welcome to stay. It's okay. I I left my gear back in where I was sleeping. I, I will be back in the morning. All right. All right, see you in the morning. took the water, bro. Weird vibes from that guy. I know what you mean. What is he even doing here? You know, I've seen him before. Trappers, they get feral from being in the wilderness so long, isolated from people. I know I can get a little weird if I spend a weekend alone. Maybe that's it? Come on, he's not gonna hurt us. I mean, he needs our chopper to get off the island, right? Actually, that's a good point. I'm gonna call it a night. You kids, make sure you get some sleep, okay? Good night. Good night. Oh. Good night. Good night. Good night. Damn, 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 damn. Oh, man, my leg is on fire. Ah, whoa. Let me see. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, God. Let me see it. 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 Oh, God. Let me see uh, Bandages, acetaminophen, but no antibiotics, no antihistamines. All right, not too much. Come on. Good day, everyone. Dr. Malone, a bit early in the morning, no? That is cute. Joaquin, you're in luck. We're leaving sooner than we thought. Oh. I was bit by something. God, it burns. Did you get a look at it? Yeah, it was yellow. I don't know. Hornet spider. Well, without treatment, you have maybe 36 hours to keep your heart rate down. 36 hours? OK, call in the helicopter company. Who's got the phone? We have a connection. Here. Hello? Hello? Ophidio Air, this is Rita. How can I help? Hi. This is Dr. Malone from, from Research University. Oh, yes, Dr. Malone. How's the trip going? Um, didn't we just drop you off yesterday afternoon? Yeah, that's right. Oh, good. Uh, everything is on schedule for your return flight tomorrow. Yes, tomorrow, but we have an emergency. We need to be evacuated. 
Uh, what happened? Is someone seriously injured? No. I've been bit by a spider. <laughs> oh, that's terrible. Well, it will be a while before we're able to send anyone out to you. No, that is unacceptable. This is an emergency. They can't come back? I'm sorry, but the weather has turned bad here. The winds have risen to over 50 knots. 50 knots? The weather reports say it should clear by tomorrow, but it's currently too dangerous to fly. No, don't, 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 don't want that. You're safer on the ground. Just get here as soon as you can, okay? I will see what I can do, Dr. Malone. Thank you. Ah, uh, dang it. What do they say? Well, there are 50 knot winds off the coast, and the pilot's unwilling to fly in this weather. The weather report says that the winds might die down by tomorrow morning, but they don't know. He might not have a leg if you wait until tomorrow. And after that, we'll see. Options. What can we do? Can you help? Something herbal, maybe? There's a tree in the rainforest. That is a host for a rare orchid. And it grows on that tree. And as far as I can tell, only that tree. The Death Note Orchid. Death Note? Does that kill the tree? Uh, those types of orchids aren't parasites, they're epiphytes. Don't know what that means. They use the tree for structural support. Its stem could be used to create a powerful antihistamine. It would slow your poison for sure. Buy us some time. Can you show us? It's a half day's walk. Four hours, maybe. So, back before nightfall? If we leave now. Well, let's go. We came here to hike through a rainforest. I'm going to hike through a rainforest. Yeah. We're ready. The professor's gonna need someone to stay back with him. I can find my drones and survey the island from here. I thank you, Benji. You guys go. It must weigh on you. I mean, it was war. But just knowing the enemy, you, just knowing a person died. Look, don't take this the wrong way, but that's not what keeps me up at night. What? Okay, killing the enemy, sure, it holds some weight, but. Okay. So what weighs on you more are the men and women on our side that don't come home. The ones we lost. That's what you think about. Wow. Okay, honest, I guess. You don't ever forget the people you lose. It's the old Diaz. You think about them every day. An argument for peace me to uh, get away from people. People who feel an optimistic sense about the future of our species, they're not really paying attention. Hey guys, one sec. Come on, Jay. You gotta keep up. Sorry, bro. Humidity's killing me, I'm cramping up. Oh. Any headache? Dizziness? No. Oh. Good. It's not heat exhaustion. The last thing we need is another person who requires medical attention. 
Yeah. No, no, drink up. Come on. Guys, yeah, I'll power through. Yeah. Let us know if you need another break. Come on, let's go. All right. I should be back in a few hours with footage of the entire island. Great, Benji, great. At least the entire trip won't be in vain. <laughs> Where are the orchids? There. Oh, hell no. Too many bodies, not enough legs. Let's get out of here. Shh, shh, shh. Shh. Era culpado. Won't provoke them. Who's trying to provoke them? We have to be able to find the orchids growing somewhere else. Without snakes. Somewhere else I have not seen it. No. You can't just stand underneath those snakes forever. She's right. It's now or never. W what's the plan? Climb and harvest the orchid. I would do it with my, my knee. Well, actually... <laughs> yeah, it shouldn't be too hard. Decent holds, looks like. You can do it? Yeah. I think so. Come on, Adam, don't. It's too dangerous. Adam, come on. Do you hear that? Oscar Sierra. Oh, no. Peligro. That's oh the biggest snake I've ever seen. Danger. Danger. We need... We need... We need... Get him! Run! 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 run. That thing. I can't breathe. I think we're okay for now. How'd it get so big? I mean, it's like 60 feet. In theory, it could, a snake with enough heat and food, it could grow forever, but the biggest snake ever was only 40 feet long. Only? 
Has it ever been documented? Is this a new species? <laughs> new species? No. I don't think there's anything new about that monster. No Latin name. Undocumented? Wait. You know what I'm saying. Wait, wait. Where's Jason? Was he behind you? Does it look like he was behind me? Jason! 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 Hey! Allison? Grace? Guys, you back here? Guys? Right. We can't attract any more attention to ourselves. We need to go to Jason. Where's the last place you remember seeing him? I don't know. I mean, there was the orchid, there was the snake. I mean, I just tunnel visioned. I haven't seen him since we started running. We'll retrace our steps. We're not leaving anyone behind. The last place we saw him was the orchid tree. Yeah, he's gotta be somewhere in between, right? Makes sense. We need to be mentally prepared. The last place we saw him may be the last place we look. If he stayed around, then he would be, you know. Let's not jump to conclusions, okay? This is on us. We can't leave Jason out here alone. We need to be making a plan. If we see that snake again. I have a heavy tranquilizer dart locked and loaded. Heavy enough for that monster? Yes. Well, if we're going all the way back, we should grab the orchid. Someone's got a climb a tree, right? Count me out. Okay. I'll do it. I have a flare gun. It's only three shots. It's not a lot of firepower, but it might make a good distraction. OK, then. Yeah, so uh, even if we find him, we're going for the orchid, right? We find Jason. You grab the orchid. Joaquin tranks the snake. Clear? Yeah. Yes, let's go. Wait, I mean, can we just take a second? I mean, this is all happening so fast. Jason needs our help. We don't know how much time we have. Come on, Grace. What if we use the flare gun here so he can come to us? No, he won't be able to see the flare through the trees. And who else, what else would we gonna track? Are you sure? I mean, isn't it worth the risk? Look, we have a choice. Fire the flare and Jason sees it and he comes to us. But maybe he doesn't see it. Then what? Sitting on our asses night falls? At least no one else gets lost. I don't mean to be mean. Rainforest is not a kind place. It's brutal and real. Then why are we going back into that brutality? I mean, my friends get lost at a bar. We just, the safest thing is to sit down. I'm telling you, you're expecting real trouble. Grace. Grace. Grace, I trust this guy. Why don't we take a vote? Hmm? Fine. Okay. You know which way I'm leaning. I say we trust the expert. We keep moving. It's two to one. Okay. But no unnecessary risks. We'll find them. I hope. 
hope he's safe. Like that, and okay. Good. Ow, Doc, try this. Ow. He'll get you moving. Oh, son of a gun. Well, you surround the camp if you need to go to the bathroom. Let's see. Uh, I just hate this. Help me up. Oh. Okay, here we go. Okay. It's good, Benji. Oh, it's good. It's Not good. too painful under the arm? No, the only pain I can feel is his damn leg, and I wouldn't feel it, but if I don't put pressure on it. Ah, too much pressure. Okay. I gotta learn to walk with this thing. There we go. There I am, mobile again. Hey, th thank you. Have a seat. Let me get to overdo it. You ain't kidding. Here you go. Ah. Oh, man. What does it feel like? Well, I've never been addicted to anything stronger than caffeine or sugar, but imagine this what drug withdrawal feels like. It's on fire. It's that bad? Oh, Still. It feels, feels a little bit better. I don't know, maybe I'm just getting used to it. Where's that sat phone? Over there. Can we get you out of here? It's only been a few hours. I don't think they'll change their forecast. Like it or not, oh, we are stuck here. It's worth a shot. Hi. Yes, I'm calling from the academic group on the island. Yes, yes, I just wanted to follow up and see if you could send rescue. Yes, I understand, but it's an emergency. Okay. Yes, it's an emergency. If you could just send a boat, we would... Huh? Capsized? Are you sure? No. Of course not. Do you know anyone who would be willing to? Yes. Thank you. Goodbye. No dice. Same problem as a chopper. Anything about 35 knots is a no-go. But they're calling around to see if anyone's willing to risk it for an emergency. Got it. OK, make sure you keep that thing charged. Hello? Yes. I'm calling because I have a group of researchers stuck on Isla Scarpata. One of them was bitten by a spider and is in pretty bad shape. OK, thank you. Yes, keep me updated once the weather's cleared. OK. Uh, hi, Carlos. This is Rita. We have an emergency and need a pilot to fly out to Isla Scarpata. Really? Okay, thank you. Miguel, it's Rita. Uh, we need you to go to Isla Scarpata for a rescue. Can you get here right away? I'll pay you double, triple. Yes, I understand the weather is... What do you mean am I crazy? Jose, necesito un piloto para que vuele para la Isla Escarpada. Ya sé que está horrible la... Evie, Evie, I have a rescue mission at Isla Scarpata for two... Luca, hey, ah, oh, man, we have a rescue mission at Isla Scarpata. Addison, Gregory, Roy.
Afternoon, Rita. Jake, we have an emergency. Do you know any pilots that are available to go pick up some researchers? Still too windy to fly, but you could probably get there by boat. We can't. It capsized. Capsized? Really? Yes, and we won't be able to send anything out in time. Did you try the Coast Guard? They say it, the wind's still too dangerous to send out any help. What's the emergency? A doctor and his students are on an island researching prehistoric sites. He says he's been bitten by a spider, and it's bad enough that he needs evacuation. Spider? Huh. What island? Isla Scarpata. You're still flying charters there? They paid to book it, and we got an experienced pilot to agree to take them there. You know that that place is dangerous. That spider bite is the least of their worries. There's a reason why only the most desperate poachers go there anymore. Rita, those people are gonna die. Well, I can't find anyone who will go out there. What are we gonna do? We can't leave him out there. I'll go. Are you sure? Nope. I haven't flown in years. But I know those machines. I know what they can handle. Do we know how to find them? They called on a sat phone that they were given when we dropped them off. Mm -hmm. Every call should be registered to the vehicle through our GPS system in case of emergencies. You should be able to track them through that. OK, good. Link me in when I'm airborne. Good luck. Going to need more than that. Jason. There's no way he stayed around. Let's get out of here. I was so close to the organs. No unnecessary risks. It's Dr. Malone's life. I can climb up there in less than a minute. They won't know I'm there. What if it picks up your body heat or your chemical trail? I will have the snake in my sight the whole time until I'm ready to tranquilize it. And if you miss? I've got my flare. He's got his tranks. No. Come on, let's go find Jason. Grace. We're all scared, believe me, and we're all worried about Jason. So, let's get out of here. We will, after we grab the orchid. We'll find them. But right now, Dr. Malone's life depends on us putting aside our fears and all working together if we're going to get off this island. Be fine. Fine. The breeding bow is still active, so it can't be too far. Wait, they're, they're breeding? What did you think was happening? Are they all going to get that size? Where's the snake? There. God, it's still here. Damn it. Remember, stem is the most important part. Yeah, I got it. Everyone ready? Let's extract this thing and get the hell out of here. I'll be quick. Up and down. For Dr. Malone. Good luck. You too. Real quick, flank. Crouch down behind the tree. Here. He started climbing the tree.
Adiós. I need a minute. I thought I was done losing people. Will we tell his parents? He didn't deserve that. Not at all. They never do. And his girlfriend? I mean, I, I, I didn't know her, but she doesn't need the specifics, right? Agreed. This stays between us. The regurgitation? We never speak of it again. Jason was eaten by a big snake, yes. But no one needs to know the details. His family, his loved ones, even Dr. Malone, they don't need to know. Uh, how's the ankle? It's tight. And locking up a bit, but I should be able to walk. Should be good. 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 So we'll, we'll need your help to uh, take down that snake once and for all. Wait, what? What are you talking about? I'm not, I'm not going back there. No. It's... What else were we even supposed to do? I mean, that thing is so big. It's a cigar? This, this is a dinamita. You're walking around with dynamite in a dirty towel. Are you trying to get us all killed? No, oh, amigos, come on. You wouldn't know if I had something if I showed it to you. Hey, amigo, dynamite is unstable, shock sensitive, nitroglycerin. It's a problem. I have a problem with that. Come out there. Take it easy. It's wrapped in a towel, okay? No foul, no harm. It's not a problem until it's a problem. Why do you even have that? Like, what would you even have to blow up in the rainforest? The rainforest has creatures big and small, not prepared for everything. Big and small. Did you know that that snake was out there? I mean, that thing got Jason. Why are we even fighting about this? Jason is dead. Let's not fight. Let's get out of here. Cut our losses. It's the tactical move. Yeah, let's go. Uh, we've all done the hard part. Was there a price to pay? Yes. And may he rest in peace. But now is the time to, to attack. We paid it. His name is Jason. It was Jason. His life was irreplaceable. I get that. But this is the time when we need to not, we, 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 we cut our losses. And we move ahead and we attack and we go. Our losses? Our friend is dead! If you don't get the orchid, you can add Dr. Malone's name to the list now. The helicopter is probably already here. I can't imagine the winds will be 50 knots forever. No, you don't even know what you're talking about. Excuse me, I don't know what I'm talking about. I don't know what I'm talking about! That drink had 10 times the drugs. To an elephant drink. I made it myself. What are you doing walking around with something that's strong? You knew that snake was here, didn't you? 
What are you really doing here? Yeah. <laughs> he knew that snake was here. I mean, he knew it. He, he knew it, and he, for whatever reason, he led us right to it. Uh -huh. Yeah. yeah. It, was, it wasn't like that. It wasn't like that. Did you know about the snake? The snake. Joaquin, answer her. Did you know about the snake? Give me a break, man. Screw you. This was all a trick. A setup. So I'm gonna be rich! I think killed my partner. so we can try to kill that thing, and it killed Jason. Grace, do you think we can get back to base camp without him? I mean, it looks like we got, like, we can get back before dark, maybe. We can go south for a bit, right? Get out of here. We can get back to base, you go south. If you reach, you can figure it out. I'm in. You can't go without a guide. Because there's traps. Hunters scattered traps all over the place. One false step, man. Joaquin, please. Come with us, man. Like, I kind of missed the helicopter. Everything in my life has been leading to this moment. And I will be remembered as the one who killed that monster. Yeah. <laughs> okay. That's great. That's that's real good, man. <laughs> and you all, you all can help me. Yeah. No. I'm sorry. We're going back to camp. No one else has to die here. Come with us. Also made my decision. Let's go. Yeah. Let's go. Give you an hour before you give up. You'll be back. You'll be back. I'm telling you, I saw a flare up in the sky. Something's wrong. Oh, man. It could mean anything that you're messing around. Allison has a flare gun, and she don't want to mess around. You know she went to West Point, right? No. I saw the army bag, but I didn't know. She's not one to shoot a flare on a whim. OK, we should have a digital map rendered in less than a minute. And it's rendered. OK, zooming in. Well, look at that. Oh, no, I think I can see Grace's shirt here. Now, what is that on the edge of frame? Oh, my god. Is that a snake? That is not just a snake. That's what do you think? 50, 60 feet long? That's the biggest snake I ever saw, Benji. Bigger than Titanoboa. That's the mega bow. But what do we really know about him? Joaquin? Who else? Uh, 
Well, he speaks Spanish and English. At least. And, um, well, he's on this island because his boat was destroyed. How do we even know it's his boat? We don't. Well, Not really. He knows the island well, longer than someone who's been here only a couple of days. True. But, like, he doesn't have bad vibes, you know? You weren't creeped out when he walked into our camp last night? I was. Okay. Yeah. It just feels like he's keeping the truth hidden. There are things happening on this island and he's unfazed. That kind of attitude only comes from experience and expectation. I've seen it. People can get used to anything. I definitely wasn't surprised by that monster. I don't care. Snakes can still cool. Why are there so many? Where are the snakes? Wait, is this, is this like a nest? What do you mean, nest? Where are the eggs? Not all snakes lay eggs. Something like a third of the species, like the boas we saw back there, keep their eggs inside their bodies until they hatch. So a nursery. Okay, wait, let's, let's just go around. Go around. We don't even know how big this thing is. Then let's just go east for a bit and then south. No, we don't. We don't. We don't know if the nest or nursery, wait, whatever. We don't know if it's south, west, or east. All we know is that it's not north where we came from. Wait, what are you saying? Either we take our chances and we head into a snake's nest on an island with, uh, I don't know, thousands of aggressive snakes, or we head back. Back to Joaquin. Let's go back to the campsite, keep going south. Thousands of snakes, Grace. You'd rather face one snake that weighs a thousand pounds? Well, at least we can overpower the little ones. How do you know they're little? I and mean, what if there are more of those monsters out there? And, and how big are the juveniles, hmm? Smaller, and that's good enough for me. Come on, let's go back to Dr. Malone. Maybe the wind has died down. Go back. Press on. No, wait, stop. What? Look. It's a trap. Joaquin was telling the truth. <laughs> what? It's safer disarmed. Come on. We just have to get to the other side of this nest. Snakes, traps, one wrong move, and we're. Look! Oh my God. Don't move. 
They can smell us. We can't just stand here. to see you. Snakes everywhere. They're after us. Are you sitting here the whole time? Recharge. You take a break? No. Let's just keep moving. How long do we have before the tranquilizers wear off? We'll be fine. No problem. What kind of answer is that? Well, it'll take some hours. We were gone for less than one. Fine. Let's go. How's your ankle? I'll manage. Do you think you can still climb the tree, grab the orchid? You're a better climber than me with your bum ankle, and Allison's such a great shot. Yeah. Yeah, I'll try. Well. I can't do this. Only got one shot at this. I don't know about this. We need the orchid. Me walking to help us get it back to camp. It's our best option. Snake is tracked. Let's go. Do it for Dr. Malone. When the tree falls. We're gonna get ready to hack that snake into pieces. Watch it this. Can a snake live for several hours after its head's been severed? If its disembodied head moves an inch, we'll light it on fire. We're ready. It's now or never. Ready? Go for it. Until we have eyes on the snake. It has to be close. Let's get out of here. The train didn't work. Come on. I can't explain. That was enough train to track a family of elephants. Okay, cover me. Wait, wait. What? So that monster can come back? No, this, this is it. This is. The, we came here for the orchids. I'm going. I'm Ugh. faster. Your animal. I'm faster. I'll do it. Are you sure? Yeah. Oh my God! Help! Wait, you gotta help her. Wait, 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 Run! It has our scent. What can we do? This chemical, it's nature. Okay. You have to be very careful. It's very slippery.
Look, over here. Look at that web in the tree. It's huge. It opens up into a cavern. I'm not going in there. Allison, the web is out here. And where do you think the spiders are? Come on, let's go, it's coming. It's a tight squeeze. Damn it. So if they're moving at 1.5 miles an hour through the uncharted rainforest, they're probably somewhere right in this circle. That, is that a house? No, it's an old research lab from the 1950s. It's been abandoned for decades, but it's the only real shelter on the island, the only real structure. So if they're out there wandering around, it's the only place they could find shelter, you know what I mean? Joaquin would know about it, right? Yeah, he would. I'm sure if they're being chased by something, though, that's where they're going. It's the only building on the island. They've been gone too long. I'm going after them. Are you going to be OK here? <laughs> Benji, come on. Let's talk about this. No. You can't talk me out of it. Benji, I'm not talking you out of it, but you're not going without me. Help me up. Doc, this isn't a good idea. Let's talk about what we need to pack. Can you even walk longer than a few seconds? You talk too much. Remarkable. Can I get a light? Got it, thanks. Look at these. Dr. Mullen would love this. It's a story. Look. The snake. and it sheds its skin. And the tribe surrounds it and attacks. Is that a boar skull? How did that get in here? I suppose as we did, I suppose. But I'm not too worried about a boar, like you say. We got bigger fish to fry? I'm more worried about what killed the boar. Warn me next time. Sorry. Oh, no. No, no, no. No. Uh-uh. See? Big spider web for a little spider. No problem. Isn't that the spider that's killing Dr. Malone right now? No. I'm out. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Let me through. It's safer inside the cave. It's more manageable. It's no problem. No problem? Just because you say there's no problem doesn't mean there's no problem. Uh! We could kill these things. They're all coming from the same direction. I'd rather take my chances in here. See? Are they retreating? Where are they going? Survival instincts. Perhaps they're, af they're afraid and repelled by the dead spiders. I've heard of some insects releasing some death stench pheromone. It would be crazy to assume that arachnids evolved in similar ways. Thank God for evolution. What's that? I don't know. Maybe a boar? Three clicks. That's... Oh god, the legs. Run!
Smell the flares. Sulfur. Hydrogen sulfide, to be precise. Is it dangerous? In high concentrations, but I'm sure we're fine. It's coming up from my head. We're almost there. Almost where? The old research lab. The old research lab. Servicio Geologico Colombiano. Geological Research Lab, 1956. All those colors, it's beautiful. Don't let it fool you. It's brutal. You fell in there, your skin dissolves while you're burnt. Burned alive. Why would anyone build a zip line over a death trap? One wrong move and you're dead. I think the scientists built it to gather samples from the middle. You're telling me nobody has ever died in there? It's purely academic. No. I don't know. I like to have my two feet on the ground. I've never seen it in use. All right, let's, uh, let's go inside before it knows we're here. Still no sign of the snake. Good. You stand back. Come on, Doc. Over the log. I got you if you need it. I can get over a log. Oh, my God, dog, that hurts. Oh, give me a second here, wait. What is that? Here, give it here. If I'm not mistaken, it's just like one of Adam's. And it could mean he's still alive. Hey, you can just ask. How's your leg? Well, I'll be honest with you, I'm not sure this is a good idea. Which part, the whole trip? <laughs> no, that's not what I meant, but yeah, probably that too. Now it's a walking. It's his leg, it isn't getting better. It looks bad, it feels worse. Do you want to go back? No, we're a mile from the research center. We have to keep going. Oh, God, dog. Because by the looks of it, they need our help. Ah! What? Looks like someone left in a hurry. I wonder what happened. I wonder if there's anything in here we could use. I'd love to get a rifle in my hands. It's like a time capsule. Let's see. No guns, but we've got machetes. 
axe. Help. And I'm sending him right back. Ah! Ah! Give me the axe! Give me the axe! Give me the axe! We have to close the door! Dad! The door! We have to close the closet door! Give me the chair! Here! You're not dying! Yes! You're still moving! Why would they die? You six them for hours after their heads are severed! Whoa! Mo! Mo! Back up! Get him! You're under our circle of hell you came from! Get him! Die! We're good. The door's closed. Got them all. I'm out. Fire! sick. Oh, my God. Jesus. Grace, we made it. Fuck me. Oh, rotten eggs. I know we should be getting close. No! Where are they? I don't see them. Hey, 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 hey. Oh, is, is that the... What did you call it? The Mechaboa? Yeah, fascinating. There it is, boiling alive. 
Of course, nothing could survive that acidic environment, let alone the heat. Look! There! Allison! Allison! Over here! It's Benji and the professor! Benji! Hey! The orchid! The orchid is in my bag! We're coming! Hold on! Is that a chopper? I don't hear anything. In the backpack. Where's Joaquin? The backpack. Here. Oh, a fantastic specimen. Oh, truly magnificent. It's moving. What? It's moving. OK, something is definitely moving. No, it must be the natural flow of the geothermal pool. Don't worry about it. Did you see that? I do. That is far out. I've never heard of a snake shitting its skin posthumously. Its jaw. It opened its mouth. Yeah, it sure looks that way, but that water is basically boiling. It's so acidic it wouldn't be possible. Doc, it's bubbling. It's alive! It's alive! Ah! The snake is going after Dr. Malone. We have to help. What can we do? We killed it and it just came back to life. Allison, the drawing's in the cave. I was focused on a 10-foot spider. Can you be more specific? The, the drawings. The tribe killed the snake after it shed its skin. And? That snake is ancient. The ancient people on this island knew how to kill it. If it gets Dr. Malone, do you think it's going to stop? We're next. It's next. Calm down, calm down, calm down. Here, here. We got this. Stay calm, stay calm. Over here! 